Rogue Company is the latest free-to-play game from Hi Res Studios, the publishers behind such games as Paladins and Smite. In Rogue Company, you play as one of 13 rogues in objective-based multiplayer game modes. Similar to games like Valorant, CSGO, or Rainbow Six Siege, Rogue Company's matches are played with each player only having one life per round. Rogue Company is a game about competition, and choosing the right rogue can mean the difference between victory or defeat. Each rogue has their own abilities and playstyle, with the option to purchase weapons and upgrade equipment between rounds using the hard-earned cash you obtain from kills and completing objectives. But which rogue is right for you? Well, we are here to help you find that out. Rogues are broken up into six roles. Defenders, Breachers, Intels, Duelists, Snipers, and Supporters. Each role is pretty self-explanatory, but we'll dive into what makes each special as we look into the various characters. First up is Dima. Dima is a breacher, meaning that he is the optimal choice for ripping through defenses and creating openings for your team to attack. This mercenary's weapon of choice is a grenade launcher that shoots cluster grenades. These grenades burst into mini grenades that are useful for pushing opponents from out of cover. Dima's passive ability, Burn, makes any enemy downed by Dima visible to the rest of his team. Phantom is a sniper that is a wonderful choice for long-range combat. Her main ability, Nano Smoke, utilizes a smoke grenade to obscure her and her teammates' positions while also revealing enemies in the area. Phantom's passive ability, Grievous Wounds, delays an enemy's health regen when damaged by Phantom. Ronan is a duelist and is the first hero you play as when jumping into the game for the first time and completing the tutorial. Ronan specializes in close quarters combat and is an excellent choice for those who like to run headfirst into battle. Ballistic Knife is her main ability, and it equips an explosive throwing knife that attaches to surfaces and explodes when enemies get too close. Her passive Underground keeps her hidden on enemy's minimap. Saint is a support character. If you prefer being the backbone for your team and helping fallen allies when they are down, Saint is the rogue for you. He is a mid-range option, and his main ability, Revive Drone, sends a drone to revive a teammate anywhere on the map. His passive ability, Medical Expertise, heals himself and any ally that is revived using Revive Drone. Anvil is a defender. This big boy is the tankiest character in the game, so if you like to go first and create strategic cover for your team, Anvil is the right rogue for you. Barricade, Anvil's main ability, drops a barricade that can be used as cover or to block various routes, preventing the enemy team from flanking and catching you unaware. His passive immunity grants him immunity from EMP, disorient, slow, and blind effects. Talon is an intel rogue. Think of intel rogues as spotters. They are much better at hiding in the shadows than running first into battle. Talon's main ability, Radar Dart, is a dart that attaches to surfaces and detects nearby enemies on your radar. His passive, Mag Gloves, will pick up items from a distance, allowing you to stay behind and play recon for your team while not missing out on necessary ammo or items. Chalk has another duelist. His playstyle favors getting up close and personal, but his abilities work a bit closer to that of a support character. His main ability, Stim Pack, overheals him for a short duration, or more importantly, allows him to revive himself when he's down, effectively giving you a second chance to fight without needing a revive from an ally. His passive, Grit, gives him increased health and the ability to dodge while down. Chalk is definitely one you want to watch out for if he's on the opposing team. Another intel rogue, Dallas, is a great medium range option. Target Finder is his main ability, and when activated, will reveal the closest enemy for a short duration. His passive, Recharge, recharges his main ability when he downs an enemy. Skilled Dallas players can line up downs and keep revealing more enemies as the round progresses. Glitch is a Breacher Rogue. As his name might suggest, Glitch favors tech and his main ability, Hack, activates a device that can detect nearby enemy signals and infiltrate their systems. Intuition, his passive, detects nearby enemy equipment through walls. Glitch is a great option for those that prefer to know when their opponents are setting up traps. Like Anvil, Vi is a defender. Her main ability, Vile Poison, creates a cluster of poison pools that reduces the maximum health of opponents. Her passive, Leeching Poison, increases her maximum health up to a cap of 25 when using Vile Poison successfully. Vi is perfect for players that like to be on the front line and cause a lot of damage quickly. Lancer is an offensive duelist. Her main ability, Quick and Quiet, grants her increased movement speed, quiet movement, and immunity to reveals either for a short duration or until firing your weapon. Her passive, Elusive, reloads your currently equipped weapon when dodging. Lancer is fantastic for stealth players who like to catch their enemies off guard. Our third duelist, Scorch, is all about damage with an affinity for fire. Her main ability, Overheat, grants fire damage when using her firearms or melee attacks. These attacks set enemies on fire, doing damage over a period of time. Fireproof, her passive, makes her immune to fire. Scorch does a lot of damage fast and can down an entire team before you know it. All targets eliminated. Trench is the last defender on our list. He is perfect for blocking routes and revealing anyone trying to sneak up on the team. His main ability, Barbed Wire Grenade, creates a field of barbed wire when activated. Any opponent caught in the wire is slowed and their position is revealed. Gadget Up, his passive, allows him to carry an additional gadget into battle. 
Rogue Company's list of rogues is varied, and each one plays vastly different from the next. Choosing rogues that complement each other will drastically increase your chances of victory. As with any game, we highly recommend trying each rogue and figuring out which of the 13 best fit your playstyle. You might come away pleasantly surprised with who you end up using for your main. Rogue Company is currently free to play on PC, PS4, Xbox One, and the Nintendo Switch, and 100 Thieves has some exclusive skins available right now for Dima, Phantom, Ronin, and Saint. Are you playing Rogue Company? And if so, who are you maining? Let us know in the comments down below, and make sure to like and subscribe to be up to date on everything 100 Thieves.